morning, I'm Janice Little and I'm the Angel Tree Coordinator for New Hope. We've been participating in this program for over 20 years. And right now I want to give a big thank you to this congregation for their continued support in this program through Prison Fellowship, Welcome Home, and No More Blues Closed Closet. You guys are the greatest. We're going to do Angel Tree just a little bit different this year. Uh, we are going to break it down into two segments. We're going to do inside and outside. Traditionally, it has been to buy the gifts, deliver, deliver them, and we're finished, but not this year. This year, we're going to take gifts inside so that the mothers of inmates can actually select gifts, wrap them, and be able to present them to their children at a party in December. It was awesome last year, and I wished all of you could have been there to participate in it, to see the excitement on the faces of these children. But you have an opportunity to help out starting today. Gift tags, such as these, will be out in the pavilion for you to take. The reason it looks like this and not the angel is because these are for unwrapped gifts, and it states that on the tag. It has the day that they are to be delivered back to the church, and it has the item in which to purchase. You need to bring it back by the 10th, unwrapped with this tag taped to the gift and bring it to the pavilion. Then on November 17th, we will have the traditional angels out for you to, to pick up. There will only be 28 children that we will be doing the um, gifts for with the, with the traditional angel tree. And that is, we are inviting eight families from this area right here in Clovis to participate with us. 28 children are, have been invited to a luncheon here at the church. Your gifts will be wrapped and presented to them under the Christmas tree here in the church. We will take a picture of them and send that to the inmate who filled out the application for them to receive the gifts. We will provide a wonderful luncheon and a tour of the Sunday school classes that the children would be able to attend to. So we have a lot of opportunities for you to volunteer, especially for that day uh, in December. Over the next couple of weeks will be more information in regards to the needs for the need for volunteers to assist with the Angel Tree Party here at New Hope. Thank you so much. And again, I say thank you from the bottom of my heart for all that you've done in this ministry. Good morning, seniors. November the 12th is our annual Seniors Thanksgiving Luncheon. There's an old song that goes, give thanks with a grateful heart. Give thanks to the Holy One. Give thanks because he's Jesus Christ, his son. As we share the Thanksgiving feast on this special Tuesday, I hope we all come with a grateful heart for all that Christ has done for us and all that he desires to continue to do in the days ahead. With that in mind, we're also going to be having a sock drive. You can bring men's packaged large socks, either black socks or white socks, and you can bring children's packaged socks. They are going to benefit the No More Blues Closet, which helps the returning citizens from prison, and also we're giving them to the rescue mission. Thanksgiving lunch is $5 per person to reserve your seat. You can put your $5 in an envelope, write on it senior luncheon, and drop it in the offering when it comes by a little later. Seats are limited. We've already sold 60 seats. So please, don't delay. God bless each of you as you're a blessing to others. Hi, I'm Bill. And I'm Lindsay. We host college and young adults Bible study at our home every Thursday night. The Bible study usually starts around 7, 7.15, and we usually end around 8.30. You can come early, hang out, and then afterwards we usually have dessert and kids just stick around and talk. It's a safe place to come delve into God's Word with people of your own age. Love to have you there. Thank you. Hi, if you're a parent of a high school or junior high student, we'd like to invite you to our annual student ministry dinner. It's on November the 18th in the bridge. Please bring your family and enjoy a meal with our leaders. Be on the lookout for an email with further details from our student ministry team. Thank you.